Rose hits a pair. Peyton gets in the paint quickly the other way. Good move, bad shot. He thought he was hit, however. Here comes Rose. Peyton shuts him off nicely. Rose tries again. Inside, Hernan Gomez. Excellent penetration and look from Derrick Rose. Good person. Derrick Rose, foul on jumper. Hernan Gomez, the offensive rebound, and a silly reach in from Peyton. That's going to be the man who played his college ball at Stanford. And as Holiday knocks down another three. You mentioned Holiday's three. Gronia misses. Hernan Gomez, good rebound in traffic. And here's Randall. Randall is a more of a pure point guard. And as he gets a beautiful pass inside to Hernan Gomez, whereas Baker is, is the high screen. Randall gets in the paint all the way, blocked. But right there is Hernan Gomez with 2.9 remaining. Hazonia launches it from half court. That will come up short. And after a rough start, Knicks finished nicely. It would have felt normal to me, Mike. That's right. the way it was when we played. No dancing girls, no distractions. Only Red Holzman's mouth you could hear. Productions, or game day productions that, that want to make sure. It, and they try different things. and Fans absolutely love it as Holiday knocks down that shot. Holiday, nine points now. Different shot clock, game clock. Rose, nice feed. Last second to Hernan Gomez. That was a beauty. And Rose with his fourth assist. Fournier, final seconds, kicks it across. Jeff Green. And that will end a seesaw first half. Knicks trail by as many. Rose with five to shoot. Finds Porzingis. Fakes, drives, pull up, nice pass inside. And Hernan Gomez quickly points. Porzingis. Watch Rose with the quickness. Lost the handle, however. Lee finds some room, gets in the paint. Hernan Gomez with the left hand. He's been thriving in the paint tonight, Mike. Hernan Gomez down the lane, left-handed. Billy Hernan Gomez now with 14 points on 7 of 10 from the field. But the Knicks still down by 5. The magic looking, Billy cooking. We mentioned he's been thriving in the paint, very resourceful tonight. This time stuffing with the left hand. So the magic have had their way getting right in that area right there. And his own you foul. Zone is slicing inside, so he's at the line for two. Back door. Hernan Gomez throws it back out to Lee. Lee tries the banker, and it's good. Courtney Lee, after a slow first half, when he only had just one field goal, now with nine points. C.J. Watson to Biombo, and Biombo clocks Hernan Gomez, who's going to be called for the foul, and Hernan Gomez bleeding. And you can see he's disoriented right there. Well, it looked like he was. I think he is. But to add insult to injury, he is the culprit with the foul. As you see the elbow right to the face. That's how Thomas got the orbital injury. They're going to look at it. Watch the elbow. I don't know if it was inadvertent. The personal foul is on Hernan Gomez. But... The officials now will determine whether or not it was a flagrant, and he used the, that right elbow to come down. Uh, yeah, like he got a black eye, man. He's got a black eye there. I thought at first it was blood, but it's it's just a kind of a welt. Yeah, you better get ice on that right away. Th these ones are hard to determine whether or not it's a flagrant. And there's the ice <laughs> to try to keep that swelling down right away. It's tough to determine intent. You know, is it an unnatural play where he came out with that right elbow to ward off the defender? That's what we were saying with KP, Mike. His elbow was there as he, and then he was going up with the left hand. Right. The right elbow is going to hit Hernan Gomez. See, the, there it is right there as he's going up with the left. How, how else could he have done it? Yeah, that, well, that, uh, it looked like he might have brought it down right there, though. Yeah. And then you see him stare at Hernan Gomez right after. Right. Not showing any remorse. 
So that might cost him. Eric Gross is like, ooh, that's not looking so good. <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> wait till in the morning when he awakes. Well, they made the decision. Now that I think what they're trying to determine again, did it come after the foul on Hernan Gomez? Do they negate the foul, personal foul on Hernan Gomez? I mean, what happened? Crowd starting to boot. Players getting cold. You love the replay from a standpoint of it can. Re oh, headphones going on again. All right. This is where it gets a little silly. Again, it's you got to make the right call, and it's an important call, but it shouldn't take this long. Come on, man, do something. So it's a technical foul on Biombo. The call under the floor after further review is a foul on New York Knicks so number 14, gonna, Billy Hernan Gomez. The personal foul on Hernan Gomez. That so is his fourth. Knicks are going to shoot a one shot penalty technical. situation. Also a technical foul called on number 11, Bismack Biombo. So, Courtney you know, Lee we talked about Biombo and, and what a giving person he was. In terms of giving back to his homeland. With 20 seconds remaining, and Kyle O'Quinn, interestingly, has not played yet tonight until right now. It's his first appearance. Hernan Gomez has been so efficient. 14 points in 17 minutes of action for him. And Porzingis starting at the center position. And also, he's for the first time since December. And the Knicks fans in attendance clapping. A terrific come from behind win on the road for the Knicks. As they beat the Magic again here in Orlando, win a second game of a back-to-back, -back, just the third.